Thank goodness you're here. I need your help. We got a package from Guster Farino, the author of ridiculously complicated recipes. He's known for his hatred of hacking. It's the 21st century, Farino. Recipes are so last century. There are some ingredients, an envelope, and a sealed little black box. He's clearly trying to send me a message. You can tell because he also wrote me this message. Try hacking your way out of this one. <laughs> well, Mr. Farino, challenge accepted. Looks like today's episode is Hacking the Case. Mm -hmm. My first clue. I bet Farino wants me to hack this magnifying glass. So I guess it's time for our first hack. My take a looky cookie. For this you'll need sugar cookie dough, red Jolly Ranchers, flour, a glass measuring cup, a leftover ornament cookie cutter, a smaller circle cookie cutter, a knife, a spatula, a rolling pin, parchment paper, and a baking sheet. On a floured surface, roll out your dough. Use your ornament cookie cutter to cut out the magnifying glass. Use a knife to cut out the handle like this. Carefully transfer to your baking sheet. Then blend the two pieces together. Use your smaller cookie cutter to cut out the center. Now bake at 375 degrees for about four minutes. Have your parents heat the Jolly Ranchers in the microwave for about one minute. Have them pour it in. Let it harden. <laughs> It's a decoder magnifying glass, but what are we supposed to decode and can I do it before I eat the magnifying glass? A fingerprint! And I bet there are more where that came from. Looks like Farino marked the ingredients for this next hack. It's time to make my finger licking fingerprints. For this we'll need a shortbread cookie, white fondant, some water, black icing, a rolling pin, a circle cookie cutter, and a knife. Roll out the fondant. Cut out a circle. Use some water to stick the fondant to the cookie. Dip your thumb in black icing, then gently press it on the center of the cookie. Now that's some fine finger food. Oh, probably need this thing for my last clue. Farino's hitting me where it hurts. Wait, is that what I think it is? It's a cookie and a key! Man, I'm good. This again? Looks like we've determined our final hack. Maybe now I can finally eat some of this stuff. This is torture. Let's close this case and hack my explosive cupcake. For this you'll need a cupcake, chocolate frosting, string licorice, a mini Reese's cup, a toothpick, and a knife. Frost your cupcake. Use your toothpick to poke a hole in the Reese's cup. 
Then wiggle it around to make the hole a little bigger. Stick in one end of your string licorice. Now place this on one side of your cupcake and wrap the licorice fuse around, like this. Okay, Farino, game's over. I've solved all of your clues. Maybe now you'll understand that the world doesn't need your complicated recipes. Where there's a will, there's a hack. Oh no, what's that sound? Is the cupcake ticking? How is that even possible? But I'll solve this problem like I solve every problem. Time to defuse that bomb. <laughs> Works every time. Thanks for all your hard work today. I would have never defeated Farina without you. Remember to subscribe to DreamWorks TV and tell me your favorite clue from this episode in the comments below. You can't hack your way out of everything, Shani. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>